Hello everybody, it is Emery48 here, and welcome back to some more Knights of the Old Republic sure 2. We start off Jedi. with a cutscene of some bounty hunters I I beefing something. with each other. I told you before, hunt your own targets. Don't scavenge mine. <laughs> what, working for the hut suddenly made you stupider, Hanhar? You touch me, you'll break the truce. And then you won't last long enough to slip off this moon. <laughs> Don't, Hanhar. I'm warning you. I don't want your life debt, Hanhar. I told you. Yeah, you're right. I'm afraid. I'm afraid if you keep crushing me, I'll accidentally set off my rocket charges and blow us both to now Hutta. <coughs> I'd rather die than be caught by you again, Hanhar. Figured that was worth a shot. Fortunately, didn't quite work to get me in. I know they told me it was going to poison me, but I wanted to go in anyway just to test and see it for myself. <laughs> I can come back in here later uh, with a different companion that is non-human. I am a bit lost going through Narshada right now. Um, I feel like I've missed the main quest line that I'm supposed to be on. I'm just kind of roaming, beating up extra thugs and trying to find people to talk to that I might have missed. Greetings. Are you the spacer we were told about? You're the one. Good. My family and I are anxious to leave, and I have the payment for you. 500 credits. Um, we 
can't afford that. Will you please take 600? Oh, thank you. Here's the 600 credits. Please hurry back to get us. Back again? Is there anything I can do for you? Lutra's here? Please, you must help me get to him. Well, how did you do this? I barely know you, and you've brought me word of my husband, and then a free pack to him. It's almost too good to be true. You've given me my husband back, stranger. My husband, my life. Thank you. Welcome, traveler. My name's Husef. I try to look out for the other refugees. Thanks for taking care of Sakwesh. I fear what the exchange might do next, though. You've already helped us greatly. Life should start improving for us. It was difficult to make out, my lord. At first it was such a quiet thing. I did not notice it. But now I wonder if it has always been there. I merely could not hear it before. The sound built so slowly, yet when you listen for it, you can make out the strains, even over the background life of the universe. I don't really know why we don't get subtitles for him, as I can't understand a word he is saying. Do you feel it is a... You... Uh, you are the darkness in which all life... Dice, my lord. All life exists to feed your power. And my life, my life is yours. I beg you, please, let me die. <laughs> through the force. I can follow it to its source and bring it to you. I will leave it once, my lord. Figured something had to be up with these, but I couldn't tell anything change when I toggled the power. Now, I don't know if this was something I was able to do without toggling the power, uh, but I was able to get some ID signatures, which is something that I needed for the Ebony Hawk. I also don't know how I missed this body the first time I was in Pylon 3.
So I came back to the scientist's room because the dead body belonged to the guy he sent me to meet. And he left a log that said, found signal droid attacked me. It's deleting my data. We'll try to get away. Seems like he probably failed very badly. Aida, I didn't think I'd ever find you. I can't believe you're here before me. The destruction of Telos? I can't even tell you what happened after, being shuttled from system to system barely one planet ahead of the Sith fleet. Shh. We can talk about it later. You have my thanks, stranger. I can only hope you have as much luck at what you're looking for. It's strange you came by when you did. I was right at the edge of deciding whether to give up, turning it over in my mind. And suddenly, you walked through the door and gave me the answer I needed to hear. I'll remember that. Thanks again, stranger.
Yep. So I end up gotta go back and get it anyway. Big ears here might know someone who can change the Ebon Hawk's ID signature. Could be useful for avoiding notice. Dear into run to walk away quick away up here. Chara nana gundoso remina ke lorak to guru katpada fever toro.
I was at least able to fix one of the parts missing on the airspeeder. Tara <laughs> Kawana bota yunta tanga kinamatura Tayaita ta bosananans chone mulera Tonkinge ba no jansaka nikaraska Tancha nik de mawimbo Kechubo grayo bog no kadaita Kechubo grayo bog no kadaita Patiz Unta chiwita inka kikraya na chawanga Ta come tak, blaia justing, miki gongo beaste, un grabila king no mulara kichi kuta. I'm gonna wrap it up here for this episode. Thank you everyone so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.